He was a little rascal who grew up to be an on-screen tough guy. Robert Blake was one of the biggest stars of America. She was a pro hustler who'd do anything for money. Bonnie Bakley sought to defraud and fleece and fool Air Lily Matt. When they meet, sparks fly. They met at a party, and by the time he took her home, they were already undressing in the car. But Bonnie's scandalous past soon catches up with her, leading to a bizarre murder. I basically saw her die. And it's up to a determined detective to sort out the truth from the drama. I think I know what happened. May 4th, 2001. Night falls on an otherwise unremarkable evening in Studio City, California, a quiet neighborhood in Los Angeles. It was about 9.30 at night. I was in the back room. I was checking my computer, working on my emails. And I hear this just incredible, frantic knocking at the door. So I would go over there and open the door and I'm like, Robert, Blake? Like, what's going on? And he's yelling and screaming. Sean Stanek was an area resident and had seen Blake in the neighborhood for years. But this was the first time they'd come face to face. I need help. His eyes were dilated like black. I thought he was like on drugs or totally whacked. I don't know what he, he was just, he looked, he looked just whacked out. And he's yelling, my wife's been beat up. We've been mugged or something. So I go, where, where, where is she? He's like, she's in the car. Go over there and stay with her. And he goes, I'll be right back. And I go, where are you going? He tells me he's going to go to Vitello's, the restaurant, to try to find a doctor or a nurse. OK. But here I am. I don't know what the hell to do. And I see the car. I'm thinking, what the hell is going on? Like, it was just eerie. So I'm like, I'm walking towards it. I'm a little freaked out, scared. It was completely dark. And the only thing lighting that car was a lamppost from the back.